Gather round, children. Tonight I will tell you a story of mind-rending terror, unknowable creatures, and light-hearted roms through non-Euclidean space beyond comprehension. Grandpa, is this even a Christmas story? You bet it is, bucko. The greatest, grandest Christmas story of them all. Without further ado, Cthulhu Saves Christmas. Oh wow, Silver, Char uh, Silver Fox charms everybody. It's gonna make your heart explode. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Just let me go. Keep getting stuck on little corners. I bet you that's just somebody actually going That's what I, I was doing that. Oh, really? It sounded like part of the track. I don't know. I bet that's so <laughs> that's Literally, so, that I that's thought so it was part great. of the track cuz I was not looking at you. Uh-oh. We going the wrong way, I think. Nuh-uh. You're finding, like, a new chest and stuff? I found a new chest, yeah. I haven't found one in this area yet. Oh, path down there. I was not expecting this, honestly. This is the beginning. Ah, oh, crap. Get ready to spam A for nine hours. I wouldn't have expected wanting a map for this, but I want a map for this. Dang it. Oh, what's he? Wow. Toxic waste. He's so poisonous. Some of the art for this game is really cool. Also, the music has never gotten really annoying. No, the music's really great. That's always my problem with these type of games that are like the same thing over and over is the music usually gets annoying to me. Like at the beginning I'm like, oh this music is really great and then like halfway through the game I'm like, can we change the music please? I don't like it. But with this I've just been like rocking out to the track all the time. Mm -hmm. I love it. It's fantastic. Nihilator. You know what? Why not? It recharges every fight. Bomb. That wasn't very useful. That works. It's more useful when there's more people. Yeah. And when they're weak to dark. Because, you know, weakness is our thing. Yeah, so. It's somewhere else. Where's Thanos on his big purple chair? Right. He's got a big stone chair that I can't believe how much he in. changed from that first end credit scene to like when he actually came down and everything. There it is. Huh, weird that I didn't see that before. I did, but I thought it was just a path down back to the other place. All right. We're nearly yeah. there to fight the the ghosts of Christmas future. 
which you know is a good villain. That's that's good. They did they did the obvious one. It was a whip. Yeah. It was the uh they did the obvious one and then they did one that was interesting. Ooh, you know? big good. Yeah, I think that's good. Big ups, big ups. Well, usually if you pick up an item in a later dungeon, it's gonna be better. You know, it's usually yeah. just how it works. For some reason, this reminds me of Nidhog. Nidhog one or two. Caduceus two. robe allows you to allows crystal reuse crystal a uh, gentle rain. I mean, I want to play Nidhog again. One or two. Two. Honestly, t Nidhogg 2 is more fun. Just in general. That's because they have all the new weapons and stuff. It's good. Yeah. Though you know there's not going to be a Nidhogg 3 because there's not much else they can do with it. No. Unless they go to like realistic graphics, but you don't really want that, honestly. No. Cosmic Dress. Armor for Baba boosts power of her insanity ability. She doesn't have any of those. She kind of does sometimes, but not really. But I mean, 140 versus 160. Yeah, just that anyway, because we don't really do mm. cooped up a lot. And we do have the egg that charges uh, chicken power, so that's good. Gold coat, bell snickle boosts XP rewards. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. That's pretty good. We won't really need it, but that's pretty good. It does everything else better though. Yeah. Its stats are better, so stats guys. Stats. Unless we we have something on for a, spe a specific special ability, stats are better. A oh, crap. Yeah, you made it, and now it's time to end it. Cthulhu performs a mighty attack and misses. What happened? This game doesn't have accuracy checks. I can see every attack you make before you make it. With that knowledge, it's a simple matter of ensuring that I'm elsewhere. Cthulhu performs another mighty attack and misses. How am I supposed to kill you if I can't hit you? You can't. Face it. I'm better than you. I'll never face that. Cthulhu reigns supreme even when he doesn't. Then die. Ha <laughs> ha! No, we can't let it in like this. How can we defeat something that knows what we're gonna do before we do it? What's the plan, boss? That's the wrong voice. What's the plan, boss? I don't have one. Perhaps I can help. Narrator, you stay out of this. I've always been a fan of Christmas presents, and I've got a and I've been especially good this year. Take that. The ghost of Christmas future is suddenly beset with visions of every possible future simultaneously. Too much information, make it stop. He's seeing thousands upon thousands of hours of porn right now. <laughs> anyway. <clears throat> Now's your chance. Fight while its powers of prediction are disabled. This is it. Our final chance to shine. L League of Christmas Evil members, come to me. I summon thee from the depths of the beyond. Holy shit. Uh <laughs> We're going to have a time. This should be interesting. I got time. Oh my god. Hey, that's one down. That's one down. Let's -a go. 966. Nice, 
so Kitty's dead. Yep. Oh my god. We're getting rid of them easy. Remember, you knights. Yeah, I'll remember. It, they charge over 10 turns, though. I know. I'm just making sure that all of them remember. Death. Chicken up, go. I love, like, the reprise of the battle music. Oh, yeah, this is great. Dude did not have to go this hard on the soundtrack. It's like synth metal and it uses like Christmas bells and stuff in it. Dude. It's pretty awesome. And he's got like the Knights of Cydonia drums. I don't know what Kinda that like is. Kind of like the horse gallop. Uh, Knights of Cydonia is a song by Muse from 2000 something. Um, that got really famous for its like horse galloping snare kind of timing. Gotcha. And that's, it's the same kind of, it's the same rhythm. Gotcha. So I'm like, it's pretty cool. <laughs> Got him to successfully attack him. It's good. Two left. We're gonna do it. We're gonna finish it. Under time, fellas, under time. We're not even actually having that much of an issue. No. Annihilate him. Dang. Half a thousand, that's pretty good. Where are we at? 90% charge. Oh, nice. Oh, that'll do it. Let's check his HP next time. Four thousand. 4,000 ain't bad. Nope. Not Easy peasy. We got this. 200% chicken. So when you get back to Cthulhu, you could do that chicken unite. Chicken unite. Damn! That did it. Okay. That'll do. Yeah. That'll do. That'll Ghost do. Ghost of Christmas Future retired. All of them retired. Yeah, and up to level 40. God. Chaos, Chaos strike. strike. Revive. See? Freaking Phoenix down after the game's already over. Yeah. Probably a new game plus. Sub-Zero. Sub-Zero. Mighty Pack. 125 slap cents. Removes insane. Hmm. Huh. Punish. Punish. We won. Strike that. I won.
How could I have been so blind? By the power of your blows, I've seen the error of my ways. Oh. Yay, it's a super happy ending. I now see clearly that this future was never meant to be. Let me return you to your own original time. I will no longer tamper, tamper with the flow of time for my own purposes. Cthulhu and his party are returned to December 24th, and a new day begins. It is now Christmas! Yay! Finally! Cthulhu finds a gorgeously wrapped present. Looks like Santa's been here. Cthulhu tears off the wrapping paper. Inside is a small letter. Thank you for all your, all your help. Come see me and you'll get what you most desire. Oh boy, I'm so excited. But first, you'd better check out <coughs> on some of the wonderful relationships you developed over the course of the game. Do I have to? Cthulhu decides to visit the mall. <laughs> I finally got my Christmas bonus paycheck, and it's a big one. Look at all those zeros. I'm guessing there was a glitch in the system. Thanks to all the repeat December 24th we went through. You better believe I'm not giving it back, though. I've already cashed in, and I'm retiring tomorrow. <laughs> if you want my old job, you're welcome to it. Although, I get the feeling you're meant for bigger arenas than a single mall. Take care. Go make your mark on the world. Oh, don't worry. I will. Cthulhu decides to visit the movie theater. We're open again. When people saw that Christmas had come back, people came back. And that's not it. Santa gave us a new film to screen that sort of interests you. Check out the trailer. In a world without Christmas, the old one has to fight against all odds to bring it back. Cthulhu Saves Christmas, coming soon to a theater new near you. Pretty meta. Am I actually that fat? I'm not actually that fat, am I? The camera ends 10 pounds. Everybody knows that. I keep forgetting that I'm also her. We've already recorded our highest profits in a single day today, and it's all thanks to you. Cthulhu decides to return to the assembly hall. You did it. You really did it. You saved Christmas. So what's next? Destroying the world? Exactly. Guess it's time to join your cult. Uh, Cthulhu, Raleigh, Wild Photogen. How's that? Finguli, Minafta, Cthulhu, Raleigh, Wigagnal, Photogen. You'll want to work on your pronunciation if you want to want me to actually devour your soul first. Also, more gibbering. I'll do my best, just like you did your best in saving Christmas. Just focus on English grammar rules and insanity will come soon. I can already feel my grip on reality slipping. That's the ticket. Cthulhu decides to go see Santa Claus. Ho ho ho, I was wondering when you'd show up, Cthulhu. Power, gimme, gimme, gimme. I was worried at first about granting you your wish, but my granddaughter insists it's for the best. Something about preserving the timeline between prequel and main game. Ah, these kids... Ah, these kids... Ugh. Ah, kids these days with their time paradoxes. Now, promise me that you'll use these powers for good. I promise. You just lied, didn't you? Totally. Very well, a promise is a promise. Here are your pa- Wait! Baba, what are you doing here? Don't do this. Just because our stories make us out to be evil doesn't mean we have to become villains. Haven't you had more fun in this game than you ever did asleep in Rilea? It has been fun, but I cannot deny my destiny. Yes, you can. You can choose who you will become. No one else can do that. Let him go. What? It'll all turn out for the best in the end. Trust me, I've, I've seen the next game. Sometimes a temporary setback is necessary for ultimate victory. Trust us. Enough preaching, it's time to end this. Cthulhu finds himself back in Relaya. My power, it's all coming back. Time to destroy the world. The story continues, and Cthulhu saves the world. We might play that one. We, we might, might play it. We might play it. No. 
<laughs> Not now! Anyway, thank you guys for watching so much. If you made it all the way to the end, wow, thanks. Thanks, thanks guys. And uh, if you're the developer and you, for some reason, watch we, your game being We want to put the credits up. Uh, we want to play it. Yeah. Our boy, Code and Design, Bill Steinberg. Art and Assets. Steern, Steernberg? I don't know how to Steernberg. say that. And then Joshua Queen good. with Music and Sound. Joshua Queen. Amazing, amazing This job. game was made by three people. Believe in yourself, you can do it. Bob, Bill, and Josh, good job. All right, we'll see you guys. All right, thank you so much. See you soon.